It's very simple to edit PDF forms. All you have to do is either uh, save the document or scan it to say uh, your Google Cloud account or just take a picture of the form that you want to edit and then you can select that form from your gallery or from your documents or from your downloaded files uh, folder on your phone. So here I'm going to click on um, my tax records. I needed to change some information on my tax records. So formswift.com allows you to easily do that. If you need to show verification of something for whatever it is, well, like I said, I needed to change some information. That's all I'm going to say. So I'm going to click on the document and see down here where you can select a document to upload if you don't already have it in your file. But I'm going to show you how easy it is to edit like official documentation or just something simple that's already typed or printed. You can do this from your computer. And as you can see, I'm doing this from my smartphone. It's that simple. And then once you uh, edit and make changes to the documents, you can um, upload it to you know whatever website you need to um, send the information to. You can save the file on your phone. I apologize for the noise in the background. Um, but yeah, it's so simple and it's so easy. So I just have to give this a few seconds here. And without showing all of my personal information. I'm sure you can see this is a 1040 uh, form. And this is an example of what you can do. You just basically click, as you can see here, where you want to edit. And say I want to change this to whatever. Let me see if I can turn my screen around because my keyboard seems to be covering up what I'm trying to do here. Uh, let's see. I apologize for that. But yeah, if you can see here, you have the option of changing the font, changing the letters. Um, you can backspace and delete. I'm going to try to do this even though my copy and paste. I'm going to try to see if this will allow me to edit it. I originally did the editing from my computer. Maybe you can see it right here. If you notice here, it's changing. Ah, uh, let's see. Change it to Joe Schmo. Or how about Joe Doe? So save. And then you can do that, and it's saving. Uh, Let's see, let's take this information out here. This is not my real address. That's just in here to show you. But um, yeah, you can change that to whatever. I think you guys get the idea. And yeah, so basically it keeps the same font, the same um, if you want it in all bold caps or, and check this out here. This is what could also do too is sorry let me just go back you can actually erase like the original stuff that was in there um, yeah I didn't mean to click out of that but it brings us back to this page and you can either select from the documentation that you uploaded already or you can select a different document like there's something else that I need it to um, kind of alter I guess you could say so I'm going to upload that right now from my downloads folder and it's simply uploading from my file on my uh, computer well in this case my phone so yeah, as you can see here, it's that simple just to upload it.